And um, random moonshine. I didn't expect that one, but yeah, always good to have more moonshine. And okay, that's kind of weird. Is that another moonshine? That's another moonshine. What? Around. Found the loot. I'm so proud I found this. Right here. Oh, this girl. You can loot. Hello guys, in this video, first I will show you some new expansion part for this wipe 0.14 in Streets of Tarka. Second, I will show you guys good parts that I missed in previous video, which was last wipe Streets of Tarka guide video. In the last, I will show you the last wipe guide I made, which is still golden and works just fine, which I double checked this wipe. Recordings for this new patch wipe was done mostly on nighttime scab runs to show you guys that how unlooted they are because nighttime PMCs do task and just leave. People don't do nighttime due to the preference also. I didn't record it in offline since dynamic loot greatly impacts how many people in raid there are. So in offline raid, you're the only guy in the raid, so there's not much loot spawn. For example, a hidden stash just doesn't spawn at all. I will let you guys choose chapters to check, and important loot spots will be named at W-ETC. So do enjoy the whole video. Okay. I mean, you could go through this gap, or you could just go all the way there and then flank all the way and then get in, but... Going through here. There's just a bunch of like, yeah, these kind of weapon boxes and med boxes. It's worth a check though, not bad. Weapon box. Always med box around the ambulance. Med box. another weapon box here. I've seen some decent weapon parts. AK. AK instead of OPSKS. I mean, SKS this wipe is amazing though. I love it. Before it wasn't that good and it's getting really dark. Holy. Mm. Grenade box. There's like two more grenade box inside this way. And this is the another Korontai spawn, another new boss spawn, and, and it's not here. And this this room has like three valuable spawns. I heard. I only know that one. You can kind of see there's a valuable right there, like uh, on the gap between the printer. Yep. If you guys have the MBD office key, you can open this and root. Yep. MBD. MBD key. I recently found- okay, somebody looted here already. Two red flares, but I'm so bad at this game that I'll probably keep them till the end of the wipe. Just use it for luring uh, your shooter boy and having kills. That's the best way to use it. Ooh. There's some loot here too. It's not bad to check. It's not like, oh my god, you might mu you must check here. Ho <laughs> ho. Or you are losing your you're literally wasting your time. Not that level, just like eh. Maybe check. Can't buy anything from traders. Did you fill in the items? <laughs> Sometimes that's the issue. Yeah, somebody opened that door to come in here, it seems. Cause this door is spawns close open. Yep. Let me check here. Okay. I'm gonna get out right away. There should be another weapon box right next to this car. Yep. And do not hate looting the... Oh, B-33? Looting the... Um, weapon boxes? I think it's really good to check weapon boxes. You literally want to buy a gun and ammo. 
eventually and it provides you right away you don't have to buy it you know it's not bad it's not like super tier but it's not bad at the same time and <laughs> that was the last hit stash i was gonna show and yeah More than good. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's the hive place and there's a full full ration crate, but I'm just gonna dip. I'm already full. Reserve. Reserve. Spawn as a PMC is pretty nasty. This place is not bad. There's like five duffel bags but it seems looted because it's already open and i'm guessing there's gonna be boost spawns here but i didn't see it like actually didn't see it yet no i don't see anything Got another duffel bag here i i'm pretty sure pmc can spawn here too yeah it's already looted <laughs> There's a used CMS from a PMC. Yeah, I'm a I'm a detective scat, bro. Micro chess or scaredy cats? <laughs> what? Nah, you guys are Chad. If you're watching my stream, you're Chad. If you're not, you're Chad. I don't know. Real. Drill the hole. This is a new place. Uh, it's a complete med, sp med place. Seems like kids med place though, right? Because of the drawings. There's like a bunch of med boxes here. And like on the shelves too. Uh, where this is, is that... It's... Hmm, how should I explain it? It's the other side of the Lexos and... There's like a big food crate right here. And then way to the old factory, to this way. And this is the place, the old, new pharmacy. Uh, ch I think we checked that, but I'll check it again. Um, yeah, there's med boxes, bunch of them. Every med box have a chance to spawn Lytic, so it's good to check. It already seems like somebody checked it, and it's good for your PMC runs to have a lot of meds as a stock or I don't know you can just sell it if you want and I bet the shelves have like some med spawns paper spawn paper spawn usually means it can spawn intel too as far as I know ah uh, nothing on the shelf nothing on the shelf just a cheese shelf shelf check the shelf 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 yeah not too special on this place but it's another like place to check if you need mess like in a hurry. I think you can get out this way too. Is there anything else? Let me quickly check one more time. Those are scaf drawings. Was that mad on the floor behind the corner desk? Where that? The corner desk here. I don't know where he's talking about Wilson. That? Oh, there's a paper spawn there too, for some reason. I guess I'll check it a couple more times later. And, yep. This is the way to uh, the old factory again. It's a fire extinguisher. <laughs> uh, and you can actually go out through here. Which has another... This is hot dog shop, you know. You go to the streets, you can actually see somebody selling hot dogs from here. Hot dog in there, bun in there, ketchup in there. And another ration crate here. We already checked that place all the way there. Tool says 100k. Yeah, I'm, I'm keep looking for it and selling it. It's cray cray. There's a spawn in here too. A PST. Not that good spawn. And I think Hooch was saying, talking about here, I was gonna double check anyways here. Let's double check. 
Yeah, I think Hoochie is talking about this place. We already checked it, but let's check again. Because I want to check some valuable spawns. Uh, there's duffel bag. Cabinets, 12 cabinets, duffel bag. More duffel bag, duffel bag. Actually, there's one more place I need to check, which is all the way on the other side. I might have to restart, reset the raid to go for that. And I wanted to check if there's actually valuable spawn up here. So I've seen a couple of times. Which I think is already looted or didn't spawn. Nope, I don't see anything. That's kind of bummer. Yep, as far as I know, there's like a valuable spawn or tech spawn. Valuable or tech spawn, it's like between those. Because I found like an M cable just sitting there like that. Like that. It's not a flying ray, it's a scab ray. This day, I still don't see anyone else use the hideout key. <laughs> because it got nerfed hard, it doesn't really spawn anything that much. It used to spawn like bitcoins and good items. Oh, you can see HDD spawned here. But still, it's not that worth. Bunch of duffel bags. I bet it's looted though. No, it's not looted. Anyways, yeah, we already checked here. What I was talking about is... There, I think. Yeah, the red... The red color. Unity Credit Bank. It has tons of duffel bag and that's about it actually. Nothing else. Basement right here. Basement? There's a new place. Anyways, this is the place I wanted to talk about. There's one duffel bag. And... I haven't seen any like good spawns though. Another duffel bag. Uh, anyways, yeah. There's another duffel bag here. And lots of cabinets, if you guys are fond of looting cabinets. Eight cabinets. Another duffel bag. No, not anymore. I, I did play arena at the first drop, but I'm not playing right now because of the white. Can I play a little? Nah. Four more here. Eight more here. There's already 24 cabinets. And... Oh, uh, there's other side too. For some reason, they didn't add the... Door here for some reason. Open from this side? No, I, I don't understand why they did it like that. So there's a room like this. And another duffel bag. Yay, we love duffel bags. There's more loot here. I don't think we can go in there. And there's more cabinets. There's total of 36 cabinets here. Look at that. Look at that. <gasps> TG armory, not bad. More cabinets, but no PCs, sadly. Alright. Those are the spawns here on UD Credit Bank, which is opposite side of the Olden world, which has like barely any valuable spawn in there, even though there is. Yep, pretty good spot. I never been there. Hmm? Good mess spawn. It is open! Okay, I gotta record this then. I didn't know this place was open. Okay, guys, new spot open. It's in Cardinal. This is Cardinal. Can go out this way. It was locked before. There's the big ass truck which she has a like a barricade thing. And then there's it looks like a party pizza shop. Mmm. Pizza. Pretty cool. Let's go up. Can I not get in there though? 
I can't get in there. It's totally blocked. What does that say, guys? In Russian. Hikok Tom. Okay. Ah, oh, this is like a madhouse. A lot of med bags. There's a good med spawn here. Where? Where? Where's a good med spawn, bro? I don't know about it. House the money, it says. Ah, okay. I didn't know that. Some random who spawn of mess will be here. The bags can have good loot. Eh, I mean, that's just totally random. I'm talking about like really good like mess spawn. Sometimes like high tier loot. High chance of um, you know, let it spawn or something like that. Maybe not. Hello, Shire. Doing good, doing good. My scab level. I'll check after this. Sixteen. Higher than most of you guys. <laughs> I don't know. Um, there's a spawn there. Sometimes like randomly like let it spawn in here. The PSG love to do that shit. I didn't know this place was open though. That's the first time after Cosmo told me. Is there any more? It looks like that's the w only one. There's some ammo spawn here. Apollo. But I don't think a lot of people will know about this place. This place is a good place to, you know, if you want to like evacuate from the fight, just run up here. Hello, another. I've got an Aletics and an Oscope there. Eh, I think you're just getting lucky too. <laughs> like, if I personally have an opinion about it. What does this say now? I guess don't go that way. Ah, ah! Yeah. No, stop shooting, bro. Uh oh. <laughs> you think it's funny, bro? It's not funny. If you jump in Concordia 63? Wait, really? I don't know about that one. Let's get out. Yeah, that was the new area, guys. I think you should be going that way too much. Maybe there might be some spawns on the cars. I guess I'll quickly check that. Quickly check, 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 check. Yeah, you can literally see the sniper mark. Pretty difficult parkour. I guess you do it with bolting. There's nothing to check here, right? Because snipe PMCs were extracting. <laughs> That's fun. For sure. We can open this. What the hell? Wait, these kind of doors were never openable until now. That's new. I think. Let's just get out. Nothing here, right? Ah, this this part is open too. This part was closed too, but it's open. Okay, here actually I wanted to talk to you. There's two hidden stash on check 13. This is this way if you go in there, there's check 13. I'll show you that a little bit later. But there's two hidden stashes here. You could check and I think it's another new place. Some people are saying it's not. I'm not really sure. I think it's new. Jaeger 4 lab. <gasps> go around. And go in here. There's some loot here. I don't think there's anything in here, right? Yeah. Nope. Nothing here too. I don't really come in here because there's all, literally no loot except check 13 room. And you need the key for that. It's so dark though, isn't it? It's super dark. Ammo box there. It's 
so you could kick this door to get out but um go this way i don't think they opened this side right nope no, I haven't got the rusted key. A lot of people are saying nobody's getting rusted key, and I'm kind of agreeing that it's not spawning because I guess BSG doesn't want to share it, or it might be a honeypot again, Luke. It might be a honeypot. Only cheaters are getting the keys out of that room. So if you don't have that key, you shouldn't be opening that door. Okay. Anyways, uh, this is the check thirteen room. It's just random loot. This is supposed to be scary. Silent Hill reference or whatever. It's like one in a million. I've never seen anyone getting it this wipe though. Yeah, there's no loot here. It's only for check 13. Yeah, there's not much loot here. Not really. Just showing you guys there's two hidden stash there. I just showed at the start and... There's one room here. Some people said there's like a Bitcoin spawn though. Here, there's a Bitcoin spawn. I don't think so. It's not much room you can actually open. Only these ones, and it looks already looted by someone. But some people were saying in my YouTube comment that there's a there's a Bitcoin spawn, and I still don't know if this room is, is if this room was open from last wipe or it opened just today. I mean this wipe. Does anybody know about the details? Anyways, what's interesting about this place is that it's a good sniping spot for BSG office. Not this way. Just don't loot. No loot. No, no. Ah, this side. You can snipe BSG office from here. Which everybody loves to go right now. The duffel bag. This area needs an expansion next patch. So it is from this this patch, right? I think it's new this this wipe. That's a lot of duffel bag though. Those are not the expensive. There's a pink house, pink place. This is streets. Um, it's next to the Check Thirteen building. Mm, yeah, you can snipe BSG office from here. That's the only good thing about this place. And I, I found three duffel bags. They're useless with the maps. You can check out my video, bro. Is that lootable? Nope. Yeah, nothing really much. There's just random useless. Ammo spawns down there. Nope. Yeah. That's all I know. If anybody else knows about it, please comment or something. Okay. That's all I know about that place. With um oh actually <laughs> I can mention this one though. There's like a couple of spawns on this garage. Yeah, like this one. Uh, it's not super good, obviously. The stuffle bags. This might be the worst area. <laughs> I did find the Quran from the hidden stash, though. It's not bad. Because I just spawned here. So, this is the bed. And I only check here, usually, for the mess spawn right here. Found some injectors and... Salewa. I really need the mess. There's like one duffel bag around here, I remember. Yeah, there's one here. Yep, that's about it around here. But I gotta tell you why this place is good. Let me five five. This place is good because of that place, BSG office. This this school is pretty good for the mm, what was it? The there's like 10 duffel bags in there, maybe less than 10, but anyways, let's go PSG office. Even though people looted here, I bet there might be the relax key or more loot. Let's see. 
Seems uh, best seems kind of dead too. Yeah, I don't really go in there. I only check that table and dip usually. I tried to hide in this garage, and a scab came and killed me. Uh, similar thing happened to me too. Mm, gotta check here for the key relaxation key spawn. Valuable spawn right there. I telling you, there's always valuable there if people don't loot it as a scab. And there's a stat uh, lock. I I still don't know if there's a key for that. Food, lots of food spawns. And there's a key spawn right there. That's a key holder thing. And there's a key spawn there. The school is great specifically because people don't go there. Yep. That's why I mentioned about it. Effect. Not big. Stop eating, bro. There's a key spawn up here, too. And check this one, right? Yeah. That is negotiation room. I will show you where the key spawn for the negotiation room. Uh, don't need those. But before going there, there's a key spawn there. Oh, ah, it's the EWR. There's a key spawn there. Relaxation key spawn there. Relaxation key spawn here. And a random moonshine. I didn't expect that one, but yeah, always good to have more moonshine. And okay, that's kind of weird. <laughs> it should be spawning that much. That <laughs> that's that's a bit weird. There's a ram inside. I yeah, this place is good. Just generally, it's good. It's just I think food spawn. I got lucky. That's yeah. There's too many. Bro, the doors were open so. Definitely somebody looted here, but they just don't know the loot. And check the ground for tech spawns. Ground, ground, ground. You see there? Just lucky. <laughs> what should I say, bro, then? Closed door here. It should be close. spawn closed. There's a PC there. Streamer loot, maybe. Uh... What is that? USB-A Broken LCD Bunch of spawns again The noodle you guys are all looking for I'm not gonna pick it up And... I don't think nobody sucked up this 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 part of the loot though Thank god uh, The squash is pretty expensive Check the ding ding on this guy. Check the mouth on the skeleton. Uh, another PC. I heard some grass sound. I don't like that. Oh, he's not answering. I like to fight that guy. Hmm. Actually, tape is pretty good. Fewer than half, really? It usually spawns full. Nothing else. Check the ground, check the ground. And... Spread. Another PC. Right. Mm. Strength level up. Nope, nothing. There's a key spawn right there too, next to the umbrella. Where's this building? It's PSG office. In the streets. MA855 is expensive. Maybe I should just pick that up. Red and nippers and the 
wires and caps is kind of cheap too. I don't know why I did that actually. Yeah, I leveled everything on my scab. Get the ground, ground, ground. Another toolbox. Pretty good. Pretty good. Check the pizza box. Here, another key spawn right here above the above the washing machine. It's another key spawn behind the pizza box. I don't see it though. Yep, I guess a dude looted here just for the key and then the abyss looks like nothing else. Um Alunka. Is there no way to stream on Twitch after Korea? I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see if it ha after it happens. So I checked all the relaxation key spawns. No, I, I didn't see it. There's actually one more spawn. Oh, I forgot to mention about that. The negotiation key I talked about is all the way there. Negotiation room. The key spawns in this pig's mouse. And in there, there's a, another relaxation key spawn. That's the last key spawn. It might be in there actually. The abandoned factory march room. Okay, it's on this this um alley. It's this look that looks pretty too. Like it's outstanding. Now I got the key, which is called the relax key. But nobody knows about it, so I'm gonna close the door, acting like it's never open. <laughs> it was this key, the relax key. A key to the relaxation room inside the city offices. And let's see what we have. Hmm, there's a duffel bag. Let's ignore that for now. Ooh, boom, 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 boom. Sha, 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 sha. I don't know what it's called. I forgot. Uh... Oh, what is that? Ooh, that the Morez. That's good. That's nice. Another duffel bag. That Morez is like 63k. Shisha round, shisha round. Another duffel bag. That's a lot of duffel bags. Mm, another duffel bag. Another Bonko Pop that Morez, what? <laughs> Let's drop. Rooster. Rooster is like 40k or something. Oh, Moonshine. Okay, okay. This is really good. Should I not tell people? <laughs> what? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, this is too good. Give me a sec. Okay. Okay, this is gonna be. If I post this, it's gonna be. People are gonna get angry. Uh, uh oh. I just drink the whiskey. Guys, stream exclusive. Go right now. Get that shit. Moonshine can spawn there. Yeah, I just got one. Altist. Scolding. Oh, God. This is definitely one of the good, best loot for sure. I mean, you can check the duffel bags. I'm not going to check the duffel bags. There's like already, I found like six duffel bags. Is that another moonshine? That's another moonshine. What? It, uh, uh. Bruh, what is this? Too much. More? This is behind the key. What's this? Okay, that's all. Okay, that's still a lot. Two moonshine, at least 300k. 
these are 60k right is it 60k 300k 305 350k 450k Five hundred fifty k. It's like half million. It's at least like half million. Okay, guys, this is this is main main channel worse. Main channel worse. <sighs> okay, let's get out. Or is there more? There more? 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 Is that more? Eh? Oh, it's 30k? Okay, I'll go out and check. I thought it was 60k. The figure is... 30k is not that good. <gasps> There's another Lola. There's more here too. I might as well loot one more time and then make a video so I make it sure. I mm, Let me check the alphabet real quick. Guys, go and get it right now. There's only 100 people who knows about it. <laughs> hello, YouTube. Yeah, say hello, YouTube. Uh okay. Let's get out for this one. I'll I'll do another raid. It's not this one. Okay. Um right, this is actually a good place to spawn. I wanted to spawn here. Ooh, SG6. I don't need those. Okay, that's the that's the hidden stash I was talking about guys. There's so many hidden stash on this side, that's why I made I'm trying to make a video on this one. Oh my god, oh my god. That's the first hidden stash. And a little silver. Second hidden stash should be here. Yep. Second hidden stash. Good. Hello, Sir Flipsy. Flipsy. I just checked that, right? Um. How to be better at Taco? Well, gotta play scabs. <laughs> okay, there's another hidden stash here. We. There's already three hidden stashes. Wasn't that worth it? There's like a weapon box there and another weapon. Actually, this this weapon box is pretty good. So let's loot that one. Even on scabs, you don't attack the scabs. Do you still attack the scabs? Well, you gotta run away from the gunfights if you don't really want to FP, uh, PVP. Okay, that was the hidden stashes. There's another hidden stash there actually. That's like total of four hidden stashes in a row. Which people don't even check that much. See? That one? Can't equip it? Oh, you're right. I just hear someone? Shroud mask, somebody was asking like 50 times. <laughs> Almost equally to that, there's dead scabs, dead scabs here, which is similar to hidden stashes. Hello, Dreamer Bok. But these are usually looted because PMCs literally spawn right next to them or something. Or not. So four hidden stashes around. Apart real quick. Ah, oh, there's a lot of dead skips and hidden stashes this side too, though. Feeling unlucky with this game. Um, it's pretty harsh at start for sure. 
a lot of things are harsh at the start in Tarki. You, keep, you just gotta keep on trying, especially the map knowledge is pretty good for, you know, getting over with really good players. Okay, that's looted. Yeah, that one's usually looted. Don't be a B. <laughs> what, me? Uh, okay, two more hidden stashes I'll show. You can see this door is open, so very likely looted. But let's see if the hidden stash is looted. Oh my god, there, there's one here usually. Didn't spawn this time. There's another one here though. Which not a lot of people know about. Oh yeah. And... Oh, oh there, there's some... <laughs> there's a scab looting. That's, that's what I was saying a second ago. Yep, those are the hidden stashes I was talking about. And actually there's two more <laughs> stashes all the way here. There's like a lot of duffel bags here though. I kind of love to check them. But I'll let you guys do that. Because it's just obvious they're just lying on the ground. I mean lying on the benches. Keycard. Well at least you got some profit then. <laughs> hey open the relax key. I do have a lot of space. Oh, is there not a single AI scare, bro? What time is it? 29 minutes. It is a pretty early raid. I didn't expect to be this early. Sure, someone. Oh, somebody looted here already. Let me double check though. Nope, nope, nope. Loaded good. Deserve to get little bias PMC. Ah. Mistakes are made. Oh, see, random valuable spawn here. I mean, horse is not bad, still, it's like 30k. Somebody found the Lydix here. There's a bullet set? Take that. Take it, it dead. Man, it's There's a spawn here too. It will go up more. Did I just check this one? I am freaking... My memories are goldfish. Finally, I can hear some things. The spawn there. And another spawn here. Found a lot of Tetris there for some reason. Med spawn, dead scab. Another PSU base. Oh my god, what the horror? That's why I love these games. They're so nice. Hmm. This one, yeah. Okay. She had the bigger bag now.
Hold on, Ty, are you here? I heard a lot of gunshots for sure. No key again. Seems looted. The max and ammos are not worse. The one I have. Ah, uh, but I heard a lot of gunshots. That's why I'm like leaving one one mech just in case I might get into a fight. There's a power bank spawn there. Kind of awkward. Mm, no colon tie. Haha, <sighs> there's like. Yeah, let's just reset the raid. I mean, this key might make me millions. <sighs> Should we go? <laughs> Let's just go. Oh, gotta show you guys this part though before I get out. The one I found, the loot. I'm so proud I found this. Right here. Oh, this gap, you can loot. It's so interesting. It has nothing. God dang it. Ah, I shouldn't be doing this though. If I actually want to make money. It's usually a bad idea to re rely on RNG, expecting me to survive all raid. We go back of the map, and there's tons of loot which people don't really touch. Right now, at this point of the white, literally everything is worth looting, to be honest. I mean, not everything. This one is not that worse. It's it's 10k per slot, but it's just, this is... Ah, the early wipe is... Everything is so good. Everything is so good. ESLM so good. This Korontai spawn. Let's see if he spawn actually. Hey, Nacho TV, thank you for the sub with the Prime, sir. Thank you. Uh, he did not spawn. In. Twitch. Okay, back of this place is actually pretty good to loot too. That's the BTR sound. Well, that wasn't good. Taiwan is hella cheap to leave at the moment. Interesting. Oh, Pachki. My skill is already machine returns but another freaking duffel bag another ES ramp it's because it's early wide which is good bro there's the same dude who thought of the same thing as me god dang it <laughs> no he looted here <laughs> bro not a lot of people would loot here though Kinda of surprising. He looted all the things here it seems. No bro. I was making tutorial man. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see he actually lose everything. He lose every single Bruh! Drop some item man. Oh, he did drop some item. He sucked out all the loot. <laughs> Jesus. What's that? It's a clean there. Except that there's <gasps> Oh he did loot the cabinets even Oh my god that guy <laughs> That guy's a loot maniac <laughs> He looted every single thing You know why he dropped all these items He found like intelligence folder and a Key card Machine the Loot vacuum <laughs> Loot vacuum scabs bro Machine gun Oh, he doesn't know about this one, though. Ha ha ha. 
<laughs> what? He looted and closed the door then? Mm -mm. Or maybe it actually didn't spawn anything. Hmm. Yeah, as you guys just seen, there's a lot of tech crates behind here, tool crates, tech crates, and then if you open here, you're back to the freaking place. That's the friend we just met. All right. Now we check the outer side. All right, here. There's a hidden stash next to that hot dog right here. I'm gonna add the hidden stashes too on the next next um guide. Is there a dude behind me? Did I just hear him? Nope. There's a food spot. Uh, there's a med spawn right there, and a bunch of dead scabs. I'll show you. Oh, <gasps> I just show you guys one dead scab I found. <clears throat> I'll show you guys the dead scab. The 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 weirdest dead scab I ever found. I'll show you. Nobody knows about this one. I'm kind of proud. I, I think I'm the only guy who found it or maybe a YouTuber streamer who only found it or maybe some YouTubers know it. I don't know. At least I found it myself. Look, here, here, here. Look at that. What the hell is that, bro? <laughs> How are you supposed to loot that? Okay, yeah, that's, that was the one, and there's like a duffel bag all the way there, one, you can check that one too, but too much, too much walking and running. Uh, let's get back to the dead scabs. There's one dead scab here. You got prone and then loot though. If you go too close, the sniper guy's gonna kill you. Okay. Um. To be honest, time to get out. Web clean mode. If you have max rep, you can have almost all extracts. I don't have clean mode though, because I spawned here. Uh, there's one more loot right here. This guy you can loot. Amelia. I don't think you can loot. That guy. That guy I tried to loot and died. That guy I don't recommend you guys to loot. I guess you can loot if... That looked like a freaking... What the hell? Can you guys see that? You guys can't see it, right? It's blurry on the stream itself. There, It looks like a... There's like a red line on the game. <laughs> oh, it was a laser. Okay, there's tons of more hidden stashes on this side. Hello. That's the yeah, green flare. There, there's a green flare in his body all the time. Is it like that, Miro? But how am I supposed to loot that? I'm gonna die if I loot that. As far as I know. Or try. Oh. I don't know, you guys could check. <laughs> At least I gave you the info. You saw the line for a few frames. Yeah, there's... <laughs> okay, there should be a hidden stash here. Yeah, it's a gap between the texture, but it, it looks like a laser t at the same time because of the dawn times reddish. Oh, there it is. That's the hidden stash I was talking about, guys. Yep. Chocolate. Well, wasn't that worth it. Pine itself is good to loot too, but I already made a video about that part, so I'm going to skip that part. There's another hidden stash, and before telling you guys the hidden stash, there's a new place to get in this way. New colon type boss spawn. Um, called MBD. I forgot the full name. Yep. And there should be another hidden stash on this way. Dynamic loot makes it sometimes not spawn though. Ah, uh, did he not spawn? Somewhere here. Oh, uh, uh, I guess it. Oh, there is this. Okay. That's kind of far away than I thought. <clears throat> well. 
I mean, it's worth picking up, but I don't have space. I'll go to the MBD real quick. I mean, I didn't show on the video, like, here. It's There's, like, a bunch of food in here. Food spawns. No? Somebody definitely looted here. Nope, no food spawns. Nothing. That looks like lo lootable, but it's not. It's <laughs> You need money in stash to purchase stuff. I always like sidetrack and mess things up. Somebody was here. Valuable spawn here and here. See? People people never know these ones. I said it multiple times, but people still don't know. Valuable spawn. Those two from that car. Okay. Just for clip, I mean stream exclusive. Not. Uh, I'll show you this place real quick. It's not a bad place. Here, there's eight um, cabinets and some random loot. Let me check the cabinets real quick. Nothing thrown down, so cabinet doesn't look like it's looted. Yes, lamp. Wee. That's like 30k. Wee. Player scabs have killed me so many times this wipe as a scab, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I experienced it a lot this wipe. A lot. It's not only you, bro. Don't worry. I mean, you guys can become a bad scab too. I don't recommend it, but... I think people need to unleash their stress sometimes. <laughs> I don't know. It's your choice. I wish I knew what fights I can win or not. You'll oh, never know that. You need to fight the guy to know if it's good or not. Okay, there's not that many good things. I found the ES lamp and a green battery. There's some loot here. It's already looted place though. I'm I'm just showing that there's loot here and I'm I don't think there's gonna be a lot. This is already looted. It used to be an unknown place, but now it's really well known to people. That's why I need new info guys. I think some of the trader scabs can see the good loot I have in my bag. <sighs> Maybe. I barely even been scabbed, but it's possible. That door is not open is good. Because this was expanded last wipe. And there's a mini duffel bag. Eee, so cute. It's an eagle. Not bad, but not great. I'm gonna spawn here, here. Some random spawns here. Call of Call. Call of Duty. Fake. Call of Call. Here, 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 here. What is that? It's ammo. But the good place is here. Injector. Uh, no injector there. Not that great, it seems. Maybe Ludex? Wait, there's an injector spawn there too? <laughs> I just learned that. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, two injector spawns, pretty good. It's the third floor of the room. But I'm gonna... That door is open? This door is usually closed. Okay. This side has some loot, which I didn't clip. It's not super mega loot, but still worth checking. It's, so the PMC extract crash site is there. And you can loot. PMC spawn a lot here. There's no upstairs. Duffel bag. They usually start here and then start looting and then start the raid. As far as I know, well, let's clip it. Just got BTR and there were two PNCs already inside. What happened? <laughs> That's goofy as so. hell. Okay, there, there's, a, there's a jacket here. And oh yeah, I remember this place. It's a duffel bag and um, 
tool set, a toolbox, toolbox there, and a small, I mean, a pretty big weapon box. Ooh, wait, what? Okay, take that. Toolbox. I thought it was gonna be gone, not bank robber. Um, another duffel bag. Actually, this place is not that bad. There's a lot of loot to check. It's not super duper good loot, but still pretty worse. I love loose being like cluttered like that. Always a good, good, good thing. Uh, mm, let's just eat one squash. Squash is like 30k. Don't don't eat it. Sell it. Or I should drop the car. I'm stupid. See you later, more. Um, yeah, there was the loot in here. There's more if you go this way. Mine's 30k. It's alright. I'm rich. Oh, there's no door here. You gotta get in here by boarding. Kind of weird. Uh, in here, there's a lot of loot, I remember. But PMC spawn in here too. There's a dead scav. Very likely looted or not. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Give me that. Huge pog. Pog you. Yummy, yummy noodles. Always nice. Jacket. I mean, I'm, I'm recommending this place because not a lot of people come over all the way here to loot, so it's always unlooted. If you guys like to touch the unlooted ones. If somebody already touched it very highly, the important loots are already gone. Now it gives me the freaking flashlight after I'm about to get out. Oh well. Is that all? I thought there was more. I remember there was like a weapon box here. I think the dynamic loot des despawned it. Here? It's not only one weapon box, I, I only looted this one. Hmm, alright. Pog you. Hmm. Look that. I think that's all I need for the clips. There's actually interesting spawns here too. I, I saw people getting like valuable spawns on these like blue mats. But I'm not getting lucky it seems. Okay, so this is the new part you guys need to check. I mean, you got um the part I didn't mention before. There's the truck and there's the way to Lexos. There's like a one dead scap here you can loot. And um now we can kind of fall through here, which is nice. That's the Lexos. It what's good about this part is that not a lot of people come over here. I mean, there are people who knows about it. Kind of bolt up here, and jump in. We can just get in through the gate. Get in here, there's like one weapon box there. A dead scab, usually, usually, um, what's it called? Um, Duffel bag is there. And valuable spawn on this table. Usually. Most of the time. I see always all, almost every raid. It's a box. Four cabinets. And there's another box all the way there. You can loot. I'll talk about a little bit more since I'm here. There's another weapon box right here. And sometimes around here too, I remember. And this is the alleyway. Not a lot of people check. Well, actually, not that alleyway. That alleyway, I think a lot of people know. This backside alleyway. I'm scared scabs or PMCs must have been here before, but just in case you guys don't know, and this is the part I didn't cover. 
It is full. Sp mm, I don't think those are full spawns. Weapon case. Pretty sure med spawns here. And this is Concordia itself. And all the way back there is the crash site. Or PM6 tracks. Some loot here I covered on the crash site side. Yep. That was the part I wanted to cover in this recording. Alright. I'm trying to make a quick guide. I'm gonna put like the clips between to prove that the items actually spawn because people are gonna say bah, 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 it's offline right man. So I'm gonna put the actual clips as a scab because as a scab, if you actually get a loot, it can prove everything that it can spawn, right? Obviously, better than PMC because people don't really know about it too. Okay, here. I guess you can check the whole place here, but I don't really recommend this place that much. It's not that good. You can check the dead scabs and a couple of items there. But only place I really like like to check here is like um all the way to this side. On the streets there is a building with the key and as well. There's a valuable spawn here and here. You don't have to actually eat to know how it tastes, right? Okay, that's the valuable spawn. I've seen it for the first time. You check these boxes too. With that great spawn there. You know what, let's just go to the important parts. And difference, I'm focusing on as a scab, not really... Mm, e PMC with the key. Wait, it's still on. I thought if I turn that off, it will, it will be gone. Get that scab there. Get the loose there too. Stash here. Sometimes it's not there. I mean, I recommend, especially as a scab, whenever, wherever you spawn, just go Alexos first. It's always good. There's like dead PMCs, dead scabs, or dead Kaban, dead Gars. Or still lose just unlooted bunch of them. Is that going to be on YouTube? I hope. If I do it like clearly. Like, I know there's like some spots which is safe here, but do not just step on it. Just go front into the gate and go out from the gate. Okay. Lethic spawns here. Guys, check- I'm gonna get all the toolboxes. <laughs> See, guys, guys, check here. High tier, high tier mess spawn. You check all the, all the loots inside the containers. It's not bad, it's good, but I always just hit up the best spots usually, which is one of them is here. Check here, the cabinet, above the cabinet. Of the cabinet GP seeing like two just like Bitcoin and um pass just like standing there above this cabinet check here the whole thing here oh it's Lettix 4 that's a lot of use and it's, it's expensive More guys 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 scabs come here why do you not loot this cabinet I mean not cabinet here Come, loot these. Why people never loot these? Hmm? These, these. Always right in front of there. <laughs> Don't scare me like that. Oh my god, double pass. And also, always check this ground. There's injectors and shit. There's on this. I already made video about this part. <laughs> oh. Ibuprofen. <gasps> it's actually unlooted? What? It's 28 minutes in the raid. Nobody looted here? Your bag. Check out the cabinets if you want more loot. I don't really recommend too much because I grind my attention skill and it's not good for attention skill level up. As spawns, valuable spawns on these, these tables. I've seen a lot of them. And inside, check here. The desks have like a bunch of valuable spawns. Check, 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 check. Okay. Oh! <laughs> so you can check.
check the two double decks here. Bunch of cabinets here. So many of them. On the second floor, there's a bunch of cabinets. I don't really go there though. There's ammo case, bunch of, uh, and there's weapon box here, weapon box, box, box. And also a bunch of toolboxes, duffel bag, jacket inside. This place, you can just go through by lowering your head. I just realized this one. I don't, I don't know, maybe some YouTuber or big streamers already talked about that. I won't loot it actually, but you can loot the boxes. But interesting stuff, I've seen Ledix here, 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 and here, and here. It can spawn anywhere. Oh, I told you, Ledix. Uh, this place is not that fun to check. Duffel bag here. Bunch of duffel bag and like random loose in Lexos itself. I don't really like to check it though. Ammo case. Bunch of ammo case on the roof of this place. Pretty good to check if you want the ammo. Weapon box. Duffel bag. And also this crate, I love to check these kind of crates too because it's big. Level up potential skill quick. Bottle of Lettuce here. Duffel bag. Um, bottle of Lettuce here too. Ah, with Magnetia! Lettuce! 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 That's the third time I found the Lennox there. Lennox? Lennox? <laughs> oh, Lennox! <Le> what? <laughs> Wait, come on. Did I not check Concordia? Oh, God. Anyways, Lexos is the hottest place, guys. Always go Lexos. I usually loot Lexos and go straight to the Concordia. It's kind of... I'm, I'm kind of going backwards. But still, Concordia, this building is the most gold. Sorry guys, I'm not reading the chat really right now. You tell me if the servers are up or not You gotta check the counter be behind that one. You, can, you don't have to open the door, you can just jump in here. Check here, found Lennox here and a bunch of like crabs here too. Completely forgot about it. If it's like really old news, I I don't know really that well. <gasps> Lennox does spawn here, guys. <laughs> Get out. I usually just this. Gotta crouch too, though. It's a bit bit tricky. Especially if you're a scab, it's really like old like that. And also here, hottest place. This map, I think. Cordia. What's the number of it? I should I should remember the number. If the doors are closed, very high chance that there's loot left. I guess it's number three, Concordia. Number three. Check food. That will spawn here, here, here. And here. And always check in here. People don't check in here too much. So even though everything is looted. This place is sometimes unlooted. Also check in here. Yeah, definitely offline raid has like less loot. I can see that. Check that. You see, sometimes good ammo, sometimes good food, sometimes con milk, water supply. Oh, mm, Bitcoin. Guys, always check inside here, okay? Jesus, I've been talking about it ages and people still don't know about that loot. It's literally a Bitcoin. It's dropping. It's, it's gonna drop in like December, the last day or whatever. Bitcoin spawn. Bitcoin spawn. The coins like... For a bunch of wipe, I've done it. I finally realized I'm never going to use all those 
backpacks. But I kind of gave up on this wipe. Not doing it. It's just a bunch of waste of time. Another SGC 10! Who was looking for that shit? I got two SGC 10 in this raid. Look. Is zero four. Yep. Ah, uh, yeah. You can check the duffel bag in the tech crate. I mean, the toolbox is there. Just run down here. Check the desk scab yeah, I use it. I don't think there's much in here without the keys, so I don't really check there. And I go for duffel bag. Duffel bag here. Bonds. And I saw like other YouTubers doing like the jump from here to there. But as a scab, don't do it first because sometimes it's open and looted. So I go here first, check the valuable spawn here. Uh Bitcoins and like gold chain spawns in like it's same as the interchange locker room. And also there's valuable spawn here too. People are saying it can spawn there too, but I didn't see it ever. It's always spawns here, between those pots. My brains are going mush. Oh, what? Okay, that's the third time I found an item here. It's always floating for some reason. Shit. At the windows? Like here? Serious? <gasps> what? <laughs> Should be a slider in the offline mod. It would be really nice if they do that, but I don't think they're gonna do it. Let's continue if you look from the Chickenania Street. Just for you check. Talk about here, right? I'm pretty sure there's like an injector spawn in here. I don't forget about this place. I heard there's like an injector spawn here too. But like, it doesn't spawn that much. That, that's why I started to not check it that many times. Like, so check here if, if this is locked or not. It's usually locked. People don't usually use this key, but I've seen so many good items here. So if that's locked, as a scab, the window, go down. It's the 63 room. You can check this this one too. It's like a dead scab. Yep, part of down. Um, you gotta at least break this window. I usually break all these windows. Make sure. Some people are saying you can jump from here. I don't know, it didn't work out that way for me. Yeah, it, I, I just can't jump from there. So I usually do the double jump. If you're too heavy, you can't do it. You gotta be pretty light. Jump. Jump. And then you can find big points here. Uh, GPU spawn. Petri spawns on these floors. Also, Bitcoin spawn and the injector spawns here, valuable spawns here. I jump from the stairs. Yeah, you guys can try it, but I, I don't know, I can't. There's a uh, mad spawn stair here, 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 here. Wow, offline raids are really bad. Yeah, boy! Get on that shit! Oh, RFIDR, that's not bad. It's not that expensive though, right? Artify DR used to be such an expensive item, but nowadays it's not really. Oh, this is a scab. I don't mind what people are watching. Oh, see? Yeah, Tetris gets spawned, see? I found it so many times. I got lucky again. I can see it. 
check the duffel bag here usually there and like basement checking basement is pretty nice too but um i don't usually check it because a lot of people really check it a lot some people are saying there's valuable spawn there too but i'm thinking it's just random spawn check over all these spawns like there's valuable spawns and shit i mean i mean i mean um not valuable spawns just tech spawns yada 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 yeah this is all fine already guys the servers are down um there's a hidden stash here and toolbox here usually weapon box here as a scab i usually just get out i always tell you just get out if your bags are full whenever you linger around longer you'll get you, higher chance you can die extract campers just random player scab thinking that you have pretty good shit pick duffel bag Duffel bag, tool, toolbox if you want, toolbox, bunch of like random tech spawns there. And there's a hidden stash here. Learn from you guys. Yay. I don't think a lot of people are checking these ones. I learned it from you guys, from the viewers. Pretty interesting. And this whole place is a like bunch of toolboxes and the ammo case. I mean, I mean the weapon box. And um, yep, that's gap here too. I should have said like important whenever I see the important ones. There's like, um, if you guys want grenades, this this place is actually one of the best places to check the grenade boxes. Actually, let's talk about that real quick. It's not working. It's offline, right? Asia is down. There's there's uh there's grenade box there. And actually, there's another. Another hidden stash here. Wow. Because of the dynamic loot, it didn't it didn't spawn that much. Bunch of tool toolboxes and um, grenade cases. Random toolkit. Uh grenade box. And the weapon case. This one's lootable too. There's another grenade case because I've been talking about it. I'll just like keep it up. Um Inside here, like you could check too. I don't really check it. There's duffel bag and two jacket, toolbox, toolbox, it, toolbox, toolbox, grenade box, bunch of ammo spawns there. Ugh. I need to get a drink. Yeah, it's an offline raid. I'm just doing like a guy real quick while it's off. I don't really know about the Sparza, but I'm pretty sure there's not much. I remember there's like a couple of duffel bags and that that was about it all the way here like in here i don't think it's worth coming in though. it takes too much time there's a duffel bag there it's one of the task plays uh it's like broadcasting part three or something all fast can't even scab yeah there's duffel bag here i didn't know that one and but you gotta be careful whenever you're on crane it's it's pmc extract there's a lot of ai scabs still to like protect you and fight the pmc's off it's kind of fun to like camp here and kill the pmc's too but overall it's kind of dangerous a lot of pmc's come over to um, extract uh let's talk about this room too let's check 15. it's pretty good yeah eft servers are down offline razor working that scab you can check Every, every servers are down, I think. So here, there's a lot of loot, but I don't know. I don't really like this place as a scab, especially because it's always looted by PMC or a scab. You can check here for like random loot. But definitely check here, valuable spawn. Sometimes like it's buried in here, like GP coin buried in here. I dropped it, but you can't see it, right? It's in there. Sometimes Bitcoin is just in there and you can't see it. Check the desk gap. And sometimes toolbox is there. I don't see it. Mm, and check inside these rooms too. I'm pretty sure there's not much like that much valuable spawns here. Maybe this. I think it was like this table and this chair. And here. Here like Tetris can spawn in the valuables. 
didn't spawn that much. But whenever I come as a scab, it's all looted. It's like one of the PMC hotspots. Check the box, check the cabinets. Yeah, guys, the servers are down. Check that scab. PC. Mm, sometimes PC components are just lying here. Like, GPU can lie there. And I've seen, like, vodkas here. I can't exactly remember. A bunch of food spawns. Spawns, sugar can spawn. Sometimes even moonshine. Oh, we'd love to check inside here, too. Okay, I'll forget about it now. Too much time on it. <laughs> and check here, duffel bag. Um, check the mess spawns here, here, here. Duffel bag. Yeah, I don't really like this room. Jacket. I mean, this building. It has good loot, but also like it's it's been too dominated by PMCs usually. It's check 15 building. You gotta go upstairs to actually get the good loot. So people use this place for check 15, but there's some good loot in here for some reason. It's G6. I don't get that like idea. If you have like the iron gate key, you can check out here and here. Here. I don't really recommend it though. I don't think it's that good. There's two desk gaps to check. It's, it's a task room too. Um. So check 15 is this way. Our prone. Get up. And up here. Check what items are spawned. Generally. It looks like a shitty loot. Wait, I didn't bring the key? What? I thought I just check 15. But anyways, uh, as a scab you won't you won't find anything anyway. I'm a scab main and scab channel, so I should be focusing on scab wise. Kick this door to get out. Wait, you get looting experience from door breached? I didn't know that. Some food now. Oh. <laughs> what am I saying? Okay. Let's move on to the post office building because... Hmm, I mean, these buildings are not bad too and there's also one place to park cores. I think it's pretty good here, especially as a scab. Jumping through here to go to Lexos right away. Because you'll meet a lot of PMCs here and also here. Well, Tarbank trick... Hmm... It's, you can do it on the both sides here and here. Break this window. Yes, and then... <laughs> and then sit. Sit down, look up. That, look that. Go on the second one too. That was the overall, like, the Tech 15 room and also tar bank. The scabs. There's a bunch of, bunch of rooms here and there. I mean, there's a pretty interesting side B spot up, up, all the way up here. But I don't really recommend you guys to go there and, like, loot. There's not much loot. There's a couple of duffel bags. Yeah, all my servers are down, guys. Mm, this this building is pretty good for checking out the, all the cabinets, right? I think it's this building. Yeah, there's like 40 40 cabinets here. Pick these for like random drinks and tech spawns, tech spawns, tech spawns. I think also in here, yeah, toolbox. So this is the post office, and this is the. 
This is the sky bridge. There's some loot and like a mountain machine gun there. And uh, if you get the sky bridge key, you can go through that. It used to be the valuable spawn room. I, I've seen like three valuable spawning, but this wipe, I think they nerfed it. They nerfed it because I think they removed they moved the valuable spawns to the uh, other the expansion area. I'm doing a loop guide. Um, cabinets if you want. Finally, some food. Yep, it's awful. I'm ready for the tutorial. Val um, injector spawn in the valuable spawns there. It isn't. God damn. Check here, here for like random good spawn. It's usually the. What's the definition of this? Household materials usually, but sometimes it spawns good shit. Okay. And important from now on. Very important. Hmm. Get check here for the PC spawn. Uh, PC blocks. There's a bunch of PC blocks in cabinets. PC cabinet. Damn it. Samuel, that's too long. I'm not gonna read all that. Spool spawns. It's too long, bro. I'm busy. I can't just read one guy's like whole chat, bro. You gotta make it into like one one sentence. Just say this raid was shit, and then I'll be like, okay. I need the zombie glasses, dude. I've been scamming thousand raids this wipe. I've only seen two of them. Um, check here for intel spawn. Check here for oh, that's the first time I found the intelligence folder there. That is. <gasps> Bro, team <dude>. blue. <gasps> Intel. I'm gonna take that. <laughs> I've seen twice this wipe. Important. And also, check here the piggyback riding room. Valuable spawns. But here, I've seen Bitcoin and Obdurbus. It's a really weird place, I know. A lot of people miss it. Guys, what the fuck? You gotta always check here. Guys, you gotta always check here, okay? This guy didn't check here. Who opened this door and didn't get the Bitcoin on the doorway right here. Always check it. PC spawn, I uh, PC and then valuable spawn. I'm pretty sure there. Valuable spawn here where the piggies are having fun. Mm, yep, that's about it. And this leads to the other side of the. I I kind of like. Checking, no, it's not here actually. It's not that worse. Um, eggs there too. <laughs> but like the golden egg. Be careful for the tech spawns, there's tech spawns here. This is also an important spot. It's a postman office, like it's a very famous place from the last wipe, but people aren't looting here that much because of the new expansion site. They're all going for the new expansion site. Check the desk gap, check here, sometimes valuable spawn. Check, 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 duffel bag. Check, 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 check these two, sometimes expensive tool parts. Ammo case. Grenade case. Toolbox here, but the important part is this part. Some ammo's in there. So in here there's a intel spawn. Some ammo boxes there i mean i mean the weapon boxes some food spawns and ammos so only the intel spawn is important on that side really but this side this side you gotta check the doorway again it's kind of weird but doorway there's items there valuable spawns on the table bottom here also check inside the book below the book Here for the battle spawn inside there, here, or above. Spawn, wood spawn. Yep, that's about it. The important part in here, but you can still like loot the tech spawns around here, and also like the full bags. There's a jacket there. I'm gonna cut this video or we. Or speed up the interesting spawns. Oh, uh, I might just upload the whole thing. People were asking me for the whole run last time. Jackets and toolkit. Toolbox, S scab. 
Just you can explore the whole place. You're not gonna memorize all the things I'm talking about, but you can check out the important spots I'm talking about. Ammo case. I don't really check like to check the third floor. There's double back there. Uh all the servers are down, guys, I think. I won't go to the um, You go up through here. You can almost go out through any any places. Basement descent is this extract for scabs here. Ah, uh, it is offline radar. <laughs> He's asking how I'm playing the game. Duffel bag, scab, sometimes like valuable spawns like randomly on the ground. Check the cabinets all the way here. And also like this place is good to just go through the whole building and start checking this place. But um can check in here too. Duffel bag food spawns. And I kind of like checking here because there's a lot of ammo boxes here. Especially guy PMC enjoyers check ammo boxes. That's a locked room, maybe a honey popper or cheater. Grenade box, ammo box, grenade box, ammo box. Okay, we're here. Oh god. <laughs> there's so many places to go. Uh, Pinewood has a bunch of loot, but not really top tier loot, so I don't really go there. In this way, there's jewelry shop and uh, near Kamchatskaya. It's pretty good to check. But I love this place, going all the way here. I usually go there, and then if you go near this fire... Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you don't even have to go that near. Oh, yeah, and the infamous bloody rusted key spawns all the way in the... cut. Clean mob um shopping mall. Oh, let's check there real quick. It's definitely light house. That's scav. Did I just join? Oh, and I fear it. Thank you for the 200 beast though. The, the servers are down. That's why I'm playing offline raid talking about like loop guide. There's a PC block all the way there. I don't really check it. Stuffle bags in here too. I don't really check it though. Too much of a waste of time. Uh, bloody rustic key spawns here. It's a pretty funny key. It's like a march room with only. Or actually, there's a bunch of valuable spawns too, actually. But it's focused on keys. There's two toolbox usually there. There's scab, and sometimes on this display, I've seen like golden G phone and valuables. It's kind of interesting. And you can venture through all the way in here, go up and then venture through all the way. But I don't think there's like a really good spawn there. So I don't really recommend you guys going there really. So what I can tell you on this part is that just go here to the toy shop. And check the desk scabs. Bullet wine pew. Scab and somebody was saying valuables can spawn here, but I've never seen it. So check the death scab over here. Check the death scab. Go up. And I'm pretty sure there's nothing around here. But there's toolbox here. There's there's one there. Dynamic loot. Here. There's mess spawn here, some, sometimes injector. I found Tetris here for some reason. It's like a random tech spawn. Doesn't spawn that much though. And then... Run all the way here. Check the duffel bag here real quick. Or actually it's the death scab. You gotta go all the way here. It's actually a waste of time in my opinion. Death scab and a toolbox. And you can venture through here again. Don't really recommend it though. On Lighthouse, you're going Charlotte and or Rogue Camp. I, if you're scabbing, I definitely recommend you to go Rogue Camp. Because Charlottes are mostly looted. It depends on where you spawn. If you spawn on Charlotte, check out Charlotte. If you spawn on near Rogue Camp, go Rogue Camp. But you gotta learn how to deal with them. That's another problem. Don't know the map well. And if you go this way... You kick this door to go to Beluga. 
You can go through the third floor and check if the loose are there. Like sometimes... Okay, you know what? Let's go up there. There's a pretty good room in here. Sometimes PMC is looted and then like not loot the important spots. But I don't really recommend it. It's usually very well looted. I mean offline raid guys, it's offline raid. You can do offline raid. Maybe like practice your map knowledge on the offline raids while the servers are But as a scab, I love checking up here because there's a hookah. <laughs> no, not because it's a there's a hookah. I heard there's like Moonshine and Bald Cup whiskey spawns there too, but I've never seen it really. Check B's couch. Found two bitcoins. Bitcoin, gold chain, GP coin. There's weapon box sometimes here. Ammo case. Actually, there's another ammo case here. Didn't spawn this time because of that ammo. How long has been the game down? It's almost an hour, right? It's a duffel bag here, desk gap there. A couple more duffel bags around. Full box there. Thing. This is the most lovely place I love to go because it's the end of the map and people don't come here that much. Recently, there has been a lot. There has been a lot of people coming in though. So we go up these stairs. There's an office. You can spawn. There's like random spawn there. Not really important. Check here. Valuable spawn. SGC10 was just like. Penetrating through the table or Bitcoin inside. You gotta aim it to see it. It's inside the book. It's so stupid they keep it like that. There's, there's um, injector spawn, valuable spawn, injector spawn, valuable spawn, injector spawn, valuable spawn, injector spawn, valuable spawn. You see the pass, right? There too. There too. It's not that. This, this one is the most like high possibility. These ones are not really. And I've seen like a paper spawning here, which means Intel can spawn too, as far as I know. Here, valuable spawn here. I've seen so many big and eggs there. And Intel, Intel, Intel possible to spawn. Everybody comes over and asks me, dude, did you get anything from the scabs? No. Did you get anything from the scabs? No. But PSG said, no. I mean, it's alright. It's, it's alright for you guys to ask, but it's all BSG's fucking fault. One day we could do- Yeah, I thought it was- Ooh, it till Here, the patch. Random loot inside. Valuable. Here for the injector. Bitcoin? Give me that Bitcoin. There it is. Fake Bitcoin. Oh, SGC-10, see? Spawn here too. That's injector and valuable spawns. This house is pretty good to check too. Check the... What is that? Is that thermite? Oh, that's a Mayo. Check here, here, here for tech spawn. I've seen Tetris, two of them spawning here. Valuable spawns here, for some reason, it hasn't been spawning a lot recently. The tech spawn here, here, Tetris, and waters are pretty worse to pick it up. Valuable spawns. Toolbox there, tool, tool spawns, tech spawns. And just ammo spawn. There's sometimes like. Valuable spawn, valuable spawn, Tetri I found Tetris here. Valuable spawn. spawn. Wait, I got 10 minutes left? Valuable spawn on the ground, here, here, here. Tetris spawn. Here. These are all not Tetris. So many people have been saying those look like Tetris. And a bunch of food spawns here. Oh my god. Gold chain. 
Oh, Tetris. See, this this place, this whole like building has a lot of Tetris spawns. Wait, really? There's a Tetris here too, though. Um, where? Oh, what? <laughs> Thank you, man. Still have like a lot more place to check. I think I checked like. I think like quarter of the map is still left, but I I use forty minutes. Isn't isn't the whole raid fifty minutes? Holy shit! This this place doesn't have too much items. Oh, be okay. Never mind. <laughs> BS is not bad. I run scab reserve and I get out under K to five nine hundred K. That's nice. Best map is the map you know the most, guys. Especially the ones that people don't know. I like to go this way right away. Because there's a free safe all the way here. We jump through here. A cure for random spawn. A cure for the free safe. It's not looted. Fine. Um, a couple more places to check, I guess. Uh, I don't really check here, but I'll, I'll tell you real quick. There's like a little box here. And some spawns here. These, we all need keys for these. Okay, we don't have time for this. What am I doing? You get, get out through here. This is one of the places, the best places to pop the flare, guys, as a scab. Scabs will protect you and ex literally the extract is right next to you. Cardinal complex. Um, yeah, the, the, I forgot exactly. There's a lot to cover still. You can check those places for like, up of boxes and shit. Server's dead G. That's probably sleeping. I mean, Russia has like similar timeline as mine. Not that sleepy time. Mess spawns, mess spawns. Mess spawn. Some random food spawn. Spawn. Up here. It's not really like valuable loot, but also like quite worse to check because all the loots are clustered in this room. It's 3 p.m., yeah. If you go all the way up here, second floor doesn't have anything. Third floor has one one room that you can loot like a bunch of items. And not a lot of people come here too. It's pretty nice. There's a suitcase there usually. There's nothing in here as far as I know. Suitcase here too. Wow. Okay, offline rays are really empty. All the dynamic loots are gone. Weapon box there. Box here. Some food spawns. I found sugar. Weapon box, weapon box, weapon box. And also cabinets. Random random weapon standing. Yep, that's about it in this room. I found intel in one of the drawers before in this apartment, but that's just luck. Yep. Intel access key card. I'm pretty sure blue folders can even spawn too. Um, little tip for scabs: you jump here and extract through complex build. Jump here to extract through complex build. As a PMC, it wasn't a good idea because. Legs are gonna get broken or not. This building has nothing, really. There's like a couple mad boxes and shit. Recommend it. Weapon box, couple weapon box and ammo cases there. Uh, oh, there's a free safe all the way here too. So it's it's kind of spread around too much on these cardinal buildings. I don't really recommend you guys to loot it, but if you spawn here, might as well check. It's like mid tier. I say it again. 
The top tier is to just go to Lexos all the time. It's just too good. Pick the med box. And the nade box. Another box can spawn all the way there. Nade box there. Weapon box there. But upstairs. AK can spawn, yep. But those are just random gun spawns. It's nice to check up here too inside, but there's a this safe. People think this safe is looted, or it's not. You should be able to close this and open it again. That's kind of weird. You should be able to do that. It might be only offline raid that doesn't work. Because in online raids, it always works. Duffel bag. Right, guys? Some of you guys know that, right? This bathroom. Duffel bag. Random loot. It might be offline bug, yeah. Spawn, full spawn. Sometimes in offline, containers just aren't able to interact with. Interesting. I haven't done offline raids that much, so I don't know. This mess spawn here. Random spawns, random spawns in here too. Yeah, I don't really recommend this place that much. It's okay-ish to check as a normal. And there's a funny, funny boost here. <laughs> <laughs> Which I found. Yep, pretty funny. Check the duffel bag. And check here for some valuable spawn dollars and shit. <sighs> check here for random spawns. Here too for the valuable spawns. Some valuable spawns here too, I'm pretty sure. Yep, not really top tier place to check. the window and jump out you can't I would definitely love to do that but these windows are all fake you can't break it you can't go through server's not working I'm pretty sure you can go through these though you can go through these ones but the second floor and third floor doesn't work that's the jewelry shop golden world I've seen cat here. Uh, some valuable spawns around here. It's literally a jewelry shop. Valuable spawns here, here, here. It doesn't spawn that much for some reason. It's kind of weird. Check the back doors. There's some duffel bags there. Ooh, okay. Oh, we got only one bed. Shit. Well, I guess we have to reboot then. If I was a scab. I would definitely go out through near Kamchatskaya Arc. That's gap here and that office force to loot. But um got like 30 seconds. You gotta check this museum too. This is the near Kamchatskaya extract. And you gotta check the shelves and the grounds for the other response. Go upstairs. And this is the scab extract. Let's pretend you extract it through here. So I think I covered, let me actually draw a picture real quick. So I covered... It's kind of worse to check this one. And also like factory for tech crates and like tech spawns and also uh, the abandoned factory march room. And Pioneer Hotel itself is not bad. Mm, and like couple of like death gaps, like three death gaps in expo and museum. We kind of checked it. it. There's valuable spawns there too. School, there's like six duffel bags spawn on one area and bunch of duffel bags all over the place and like right here, there's like three to four med related box spawning. Yeah, guys, it's, this one is the RBK, um, Rusted Bloody Key. My bad. Okay, guys, from the last part, I checked all these parts. There's there's couple really important parts I didn't really show you guys, so I'm gonna additionally record it. This plate is really important. Uh, these part, this part is pretty nice too. There's like a 
a lot of PCs and valuable spawns. Okay, those two parts, I guess, then. Along the way, maybe I'll check more. This place is not bad, too. Museum, I didn't really show you guys. School, there's a bunch of duffel bags, which is interesting. I think too good. There's check 13 here, but like, I mean, I'm a scab, so I'm checking that much. Abandoned factory, march room, and also like some big crates that you can check are nice too. Okay, let's see where, where I spawned. I spawned at here. Okay. Oh, actually the place I wanted to go. This is the, this is the building I was talking about. There's a lot of PCs here. Up through here. Greenhouse, green building. There's a PC here. Somebody found the Lettix here. Dead scab. It's a it's a random medical spawn. Dead scab. PC. PC. And a PC. Okay. Not much in here. There's toolbox on there. There's a lot of cabinets here. If you guys want to check duffel bag. I don't think there's PCs here. Nope. And uh, pretty sure you can get out through here. Get out. I think this is the building, the bloody rusted key opening building. You can see this astronaut and the wall painting. It's a pretty interesting place too. You can loot the top floor. There's two big weapon boxes. Mainly PMCs come here, but I don't know. As a scab, where whenever I come over here, it's never open too, which is a bit weird. Um, this is the bloody rusty key opening room. Need the key. It's a pretty nasty key. There's a task too. Uh, there's a lot of keys. A lot of expensive key spawning or pretty key. Also valuables. It's those. It's a. It's like a reference of a Silent Hill. And two big weapon crates. Nice to check. But you gotta jump a lot and use um spend. You use too many stamina's. Kinda nasty actually. This building connects to the office that I love to check to. Their desk, gap and a PC. And if you go through this door, this is the office building I love to check. Um, you can come through here, which is here. Okay, I'll, I'll show you guys how to get it. Um, you usually come through here after seeing the museum. The museum's here again. Here, Kamchatskaya Arc Extract for Scabs are here. But since we're here, let's extract again. That's where the last part ended, the previous part ended. And you can check here, 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 here. Here for a double to get back. Here, 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 here. Where I'm saying here is all valuable spawns. There's a toolbox that spawned there. Jacket, valuable spawn on the here, 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 here. But somehow they don't spawn that much. I think they lower the spawn chance a little. Here on the ground, ground on the bed too. A lot of horses. Actual good spawns too. Uh, yeah. And after that, you can go through this green building underground. Then, there's toolbox usually here. Check that, and then go here. Go back to the office I was talking about. Why I like about this office is because of this Russian president. Not really. That was a worse joke. We go through here. There's a free safe right there. And a PC. And cabinets if you guys want to check. And here, two duffel bags. Bonds. That safe is fake. Not safe. There's a PC there. I don't think there's a key for this safe too. Really weird. Also on this CCTV room. Find the PC right here. Cabinets. And... Box there. What I love about this office is that there's duffel back here. But 
There's multiple reports about finding Bitcoin there, Bitcoin here, Bitcoin here. Because I, I always like come here and loot other things. Bitcoin. Okay. That's good to know. That's good to know. It's pretty nice actually. I'm gonna get reported. <laughs> Available spawn there, available spawn there. What? Again? What the f? Where you get this one? There, really? These three spots are the available spawns, but not that high chance, in my opinion, because I checked them multiple times. Only the re I've got the reports. I've done thousand scab raids, never found them. It's just my luck. I know there's gonna be someone saying that. Eh. And there's PC block, PC block. I'm not blaming the guys who told, reported me and reported where it is. I, I'm just saying I didn't find it. And if you go out here, you can actually go this way and jump up. Some people love to check inside there and here, but I don't really recommend I don't think there's anything that much. And alongside these ways, like these ways, there's like duffel bags on that side, duffel bags here box here i mean you could you can check out the duffel bags if you like to you can actually go to uh, uh the school this is the school the bright skyline color if you go to the second floor this side there's some places um i don't think there's anything really here interesting place here though you can open and then uh it's like a secret principal room i don't think there's a key for that but it's there's nothing the loot is i don't think there's nothing because i already multiple times i checked but here where the kids playground markers are drawn right here there's six double bag spawns i've seen actually being six and not only that there's double bag here and sometimes on that or like on these one like this thing is like a duffel bag spawner the chair the duffel bag here why i like the duffel bag is i found ledix vertex anything you can imagine actually except the color key cards and like color key cards or like the ones you guys always ask, the GPSU or the current computers, they don't spawn sadly, but almost anything can spawn in Duffel Bag. And here there's a toolbox spawn here, tool toolbox spawn and bed. And I don't really check bed that much. There's a mess spawn here and also Duffel Bag and some mess spawns here. I don't think there's a high tier mess spawn or high tier text though. The second, there is second floor too. It's okay -ish to check. There's like a duffel bag, duffel bag, and a suitcase, which is almost similar as the duffel bag. And I heard like in the cages, there's some stuff in there, but I don't really care. It's my personal preference. Um, and where should I go? Well, I think I showed you guys here, here, here. Here, gotta go to the factory. Pinewood. I don't know. There's a lot. Let me show you Pinewood too. Since I started recording, it's gonna be a freaking two-hour video now. Uh let's go to Pinewood. Then. Here, there's like two dead scabs, three dead scabs. You can check. Pinewood. No, I'm going the opposite way. Lexos is that way. Lexos. Pinewood should be on the opposite side of the Lexos. It's like opposite, opposite side of the map. Uh, Lexos, Pinewood. So this is like the cent. This is like the center of the map, guys. This is big center, three crossways. So whenever I think of Lexos, I think of Pinewood is on the opposite side of the map. Let's just wait. Here. 
pinewood. Got pinewood. There's tons of stuff here, but I don't think there's a like high spawn item here. There's like behind the counters. I keep hearing there's some valuable spawns, but I haven't seen it like spawn that much. It's just a possibility. It doesn't mean like like think about Lexos. Lexos always spawns valuables, you know. Uh, there's suitcase there. Some items up there. What I'm talking about the counter is behind these kind of counters. Food and like valuable spawns randomly. Interesting place update about here is up uh double one double back here. Here. I think there's double backs on there too. But if you open this door and go to the other side of the pinewood. Inside pine room. It's a good box there. So bridge, the sky bridge. Which you can actually snipe people here and then have fun. If you guys want. Here too. Pretty interesting. I I collapsed a couple of PMC. There's a desk gap here and on this staircase I'm pretty sure you can jump up and jump 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 up all the way up there to go to the bugged place where you can go up the top of the pine wood. I really recommend it. It's kind of abusing. I don't know, like it's BSG's fault anyways. So I'm like 50-50 on that. Uh like BSG fault and also abusing guys' fault. Anyways, um yeah, you guys can enjoy that. I I, I haven't done it. Because I, I don't have enough strength as a PMC or a scale. I'll definitely try it if I can. Anyways, um so if you go through that that scab and this um jumping site of stairs will found this place which is a bunch of suitcases are here so one suitcase here one suitcase spawns here i'm pretty sure there's like maximum of three suitcase spawns and there's a dead scab here with the head box so it can spawn like pretty good stuff you can utilize this place to snipe some people again if you guys want there's a duffel bag spawn here. One more duffel bag spawn spawns, I think. Here, yeah. On that place, maybe there are like boot spawns. I checked a couple of times, I didn't see anything interesting. And you can go through here. It's like a museum display. Again, desk gap along the way. Go this side. There's this room find some items randomly on the yeah in pinewood rooms just check the above the beds above the desk there's another room in here which you guys all like it's like a i don't know cucumber room houseware spawn some people are saying they found like valuable spawns up here or here or here but i don't i never found it there's another tech spawn there too beyond here or here I don't know, whenever I come here, I never see anything. Um, and I think uh, not much left. There's suitcase here, I remember. Check that. And, and yeah, that's overall the new update. There's another dead skip on the second floor. You actually go through here to exit the pine wood. Just here. Of duffel bags and items around this place behind the counter. Okay, edible spawn and duffel bag. Duffel bag. So many duffel bags in this map. Let's go back up there. Or wait. I mean, this place is oh, it's here. Yeah, it's back to the jumping. Going up to the ceiling by the bug place. Go back up. It's pretty difficult for you guys to actually, if you're watching this video, I'm pretty sure you guys don't know the map that well. It's not that easy to understand what I'm. Especially inside the building. I, I still don't memorize it completely. Here, there's a death gap there. 
And there's some tech spawns. I mean, I mean tool spawns here. I've seen a couple of times. And this is like um old Concordia. No, old pinewood looting places like here. Case the pink suitcase is the one that you can loot. And a couple locked doors, locked doors too for oh, to loot that scam. Yeah. But penetrated. There's a mini save. I don't think that's available yet. I don't think we have a we have a for that even. Here, there's some. This the one. Yeah, this one is the task room. I think. Stuffle bay. Yada yada yada. I don't really loot here, so I'm I'm not really familiar with this place that much. Um. Yeah. Bunch of items. I'm pretty sure inside. You can. Investigate if you guys want. Uh, yeah, bunch of food and I random items again here. Oh, actually, this place is pretty worth telling you guys. Oh, here. It's the place I came up. It's the opposite side. So again, counter behind. Check for the valuable spawns. Uh, why I was talking about this place is recommendable. And there's a dentist office. Dentist hospital. Right. I mean I could have just come in from there. I don't know why I came here. Because I, I usually just jump off this way. I mean it used to have high tier mess spawns and food spawns and mess spawns here, but I haven't been seeing it recently really. Kinda weird. Like like above these desks and all above this one and above these shelves. In the other room, second room, there's a bunch of them here. Here, 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 here. I don't know. See, I even though it's offline rate, I didn't see a single thing. Uh, up here, valuable spawn, uh, also here, and the cabinets you guys can check. Uh, I'm pretty sure in the previous video, previous part, I already covered the uh, flame mode. So we gotta go the back. Oh shit, we got the opposite side of it again. Back to E. And I'll show you guys the little apartment that is worth to check. Oh, there's actually here on the whole bag. Not that worth of checking. Bang. Toolbox. This used to be a killer spawn, so I used to come over here on last wipe. Not anymore though. I hope Kaban's Well, what do you guys think? Kaban's big brother's gonna spawn next to him or maybe somewhere else. Toolbox here, bunch of bunch of tool spawns. Oh, owl is not bad. That's like 20k. Box spawn, tool spawns here, 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 here. A bunch of food spawns in Sparza. Worst to check. And the duffel bag magical ATM. Let me go near it starts blowy. Okay, now we can go to factory. We were here. Uh we were here in Sparza and we're going this I should have done drawing the map from the start, but anyways. <laughs> it's better to just learn it by like the route I take. Uh, this place is not bad to check here actually. There's a bunch of med spawns and ammo spawns on the table. Which is not bad. It's it's not like top tier loot obviously, but still like worse to check. Now I think we can do a factory. Abandoned factory. Ooh. Not that way. Yeah, I still get confused sometimes. Yeah, this way. It's gonna be always a bunch of scabs. Or a scab. If you're a PMC, sometimes a couple of them. But well, as a scab, it's like one of the most clustered area for the AI scabs. Here, the marked abandoned factory is right there. Is it blocked? Oh, it's blocked. It, it used to be a drop down, then you could drop down from the third floor. Check this right. Tech spawns. Check this crate for the tech spawn. Check 
Who spawns here? Who spawns here? Found pretty good tech spawns actually. Uh, tech, tech crate here. Other side. Back. Here. Tech spawns on the desk and on the ground. Spawns. Spawns. Spawns on the on the table and the ground. That place is nothing. That place is nothing. I'm pretty sure. And this is the marked room. Um, as a scab, it, there might be a lot of dudes just fought here, and then like you can loot the PMCs. Kind of fun to. Loot. Oh wow! Even the tier of the guns are dropping down whenever you play as offline raid. Interesting. There's box. Yeah, I've never seen this. <laughs> Interesting. So it, the loot actually increases with the number of people. P M and A P B and a Glock. Wow. I think this is really severe with the how many players are in your raid in this wipe. Especially with the dynamic loot. Last wipe, it wasn't this severe, guys. People had theories about it, but like whenever I go with like solo in offline range, there wasn't this. It wasn't this bad. Okay, now to the important place I kept talking about. Oh, before there, I mean you can check here too. Oh, anyways, this is the place almost. There's a big med crate here. I create here and also here. There's some cabinets inside. Four of them. I'm really worth checking inside there, but big med crate is not bad. Also in here, bunch of cabinets and PC is pretty worth checking actually. Clustered loot. You gotta go all the way around to get in though. Or from the other side. I'm pretty sure this door works. Yep. This door works. A uh, bunch of cabinets, 12 cabinets. PC, four more cabinets, C. I know some people might think it's timid to use cabinets, but cabinets are golden loot. They're very big streamers and YouTubers and the good players who knows how to loot cabinets a lot. Duffel back there, you can go out through here, which means you can go in through here too. So we're back to the theater, which we started from this whole video. I mean, should I show you guys the theater? You know what, since we're here, let's go. I'm not gonna cut this part, cut this video part. Let's just let's post it. I'm, I'm so tired, guys. <laughs> it's such a big map. I think they're gonna expansion it more. I don't know what, what I'm gonna do with that one, maybe. Okay, toolbox there. And just a bunch of loot below the chair or on the chair. Bunch of loot. But I wouldn't say there's a... Good loot. I've checked it multiple times. It's always just a bunch of ammo and some food. Popcorn. I mean, there's a duffel bag there. There's a popcorn related foods. Like, I mean, movie related foods. Weapon case. And if you go upstairs, uh, it's similar. But before going upstairs, that's a fake, fake box. Don't loot that. Um, there's duffel bag, duffel bag, duffel bag here. Actually, four duffel bags is not bad. Uh, you can go in here, but there's not. Now we go to the second floor. There's a mat box, couple back here, and a bunch of chairs I just talked about. Almost exactly the same. It would be maybe even better to just go to sideways stairs and then check the loot. Uh, nothing up here. I was talking about on the first floor. There's like toolbox here, and I think on the other side too. Uh, we talked about right below here, the pink room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's move on to the important part now. That's overall the theater. I, I don't really like looting here that much. I mean, if you spawned here, maybe check out the duffel bags and dip. You know what, I should have told you guys this part first. What I usually loot first is the important parts I keep talking about, valuable loots. And secondly, I loot hidden stash. Hidden stash, duffel bag, suitcase, 
dead scabs, they are all same classifications, I think. They spawn almost exactly seven same items, which mean which also means it spawns anything in there. Except the color key card or anything. Maybe even color key card spawns. It's just my, me not being lucky. Even on around these trashes, some items spawn. Uh but this side, this way, there's a bunch of good shit actually. Oh, I missed one. A safe here, which is just lying casually. Not a lot of people know about this. Maybe by now a lot of people know, but it's like such a casual safe just standing there. And if you go in here, a lot of spawn here. Uh, this room. There's trying possible spawn pool spawns here. I found a GPU here. I think this is tech spawn. Here you see the booze, food, houseware, sometimes even valuables. Again, random item spawns, ammo. Here, 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 here too. And wait, I already talked about it. What am I doing? Okay, but they expanded this area for the this expansion. There's a toolbox there, and one more time you can go up the top. This is the top. I'm pretty sure you can't go up anymore. I bet they're gonna open up that place more later on. So if you go in here, gain a kitchen, the same kitchen layout, but there's med spawn, med box, and there's spawn there. On med spawn, I'm pretty sure. And you can check here for some random loot. And there's a mini duffel bag. Again, vector and the med spawns. Some interesting spawns. I'm, I heard there's a battle spawn, but I never found it yet. For some reason. And yeah, that's about it in here. But if you go down, more stuff to loot. These kind of places are the places I like. Um, they are clustered. They are all in together. Uh, there's a desk gap there, but before going that way, here there's eight cabinets and some random spawns here. Food and spawns. Is there? Nope, oh, there's. Yeah. Uh, desk gap here. Hmm. You can loot that crate all the way there next to the truck, and then you can extract through catacombs. Uh, it's called entrance to catacombs through here as a scav. All the way here, in here. And because I'm a PMC. Anything here? Uh, interesting part about this place is that pmc extracts are here too it's a pretty um general place too is the i don't have it here pretty sure the name is a little bit different from the one i have it's like i forgot the exact name anyways this is another pmc extract oh so why i'm talking about that is it's actually a a uh, pretty well known extract camping area too. Some um, parkour area. But before telling you that, let's show you a uh, famous hidden stash here. There's like. Did it not spawn again? It should be like around here. Be like here. I don't see it though. I think it didn't spawn. Okay. Yep. And then it looks sucks ass, especially whenever I'm trying to make a tutorial. There's a bunch of food spawns in there if you guys want. In in that house, in, in that yellow house, there's some valuable spawns in the beverage spawns. I don't really go though. So where people extract camp with the parkour is actually here. But before going up there, there's food spawns here. There's um big ass i mean if you're gonna check out the weapon boxes this is the best web option for the weapon boxes seeing people pulling out taiga meta gears meta parts 
Um, there used to be a valuable spawn here. I haven't seen it recently. They keep changing the spawns too, which makes it really like annoying sometimes <laughs> for a guy like me. Ah, uh, okay, you can go through here, 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 here. Up, 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 up to edge. Jump there. People. Yeah, let's just fall down. Snipe the people on the. Snipe the people on the. Who's trying to extract. You can go all the way through the other side. That all? Yep, I think that's all, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys had some good spots to check for you guys that you guys maybe didn't know. If you guys have any more spots you want to share, please leave it in the comment. If you guys like this video, please leave a like on the video. And also, if you want to check me out on live stream, check out YouTube, Kickstream, and also Twitch stream. If you want to support me more, check out the Patreon, join the membership, super thanks to YouTube. I'll see you in the next video, guys.